a little uh, question and answer. What's the fastest I've ever drove a car? 90 miles an hour. 90 miles per hour. When and where? Uh, 1982. Up here it's day route 50. Yeah. We lived in Highland County then. And I had a uh, 1973 Plymouth Satellite Sebring Jet Black. A 318 small block V8. And a real nice car. It really was. For the, I think we gave 450 for it. Real nice car. Anyway, uh, me and my sister, uh, I, I, I gave half. Me and my sister owned it. I paid half and she paid half. And anyway, uh, so we would take turns, you know. Now, before we would take the car, for example, if I want to go somewhere, I would. We, we had an agreement. Now, it wouldn't work today, of course, but... Back in 1982, I'd ask her, or you go, do you need the car? Either she, she would say yes or no. And that one day she said, no, I don't need the car. I said, well, I'm taking it. I'm going, I'm going somewhere. So, uh, I, you know, she gave me the key. Well, I had the key up, the keys on me. And this, I was out by myself. And at that moment, there was no, when I got on Route 50, there was no traffic at all. And I, I, and I was 19 years old. I thought, I've never drove fast. I'm going to try it one time. Of course, I was taking a chance. I could get stopped by the cops, by the police, law. I don't know if you go to jail for driving 90 miles per hour or not. I'm, and what I did here, I pulled over and nervously, I went and got my billfold out. And I double made sure I had my driver's license on me. Here's how nervous. I was actually this nervous. I took my driver's license out. <laughs> you know, because a lot of times you can have a card in your billfold that sort of looks like your license. If you look too fast. You know, you know, I'm getting ready to drive 90 miles an hour. And I was nervous. Now, first of all, you young folks, never, never try this. Please never, never try this. Back in 1982, there wasn't as much traffic as there is today. But anyway, I pulled my car over, got my billfold out, and I pulled my license out. And here's how nervous I was. I looked at my picture twice, and I said this out loud. Ohio driver's license and my name. And the re reason why I made sure I had my driver's license on me, if I did get stopped by the police. Now, if you don't have your license on you, they would look at it, they would look at it, they would figure, well, if you're not, if I was responsible enough to have my driver's license on me, I wouldn't be, I wouldn't care how I drove. And I think they would be double hard on you. As long as you got your license on you, I think it might be a little lenient. But I looked at my license, I was so nervous, oh, I actually said this out loud, just, you know, make sure I, I was nervous. Ohio driver's life. Put it back in my billfold. I had a mommy just in case I was stopped. Had my seatbelt on. Pulled out into the road. I gunned it. 50 miles an hour. 60 miles an hour. 70 miles an hour. And I was watching the road. You know, I'm by myself. Remember that. There's no cars behind me and there's no cars. It's you locals have been on State Route 50. Straight as an arrow. Anyway, I'm watching the road and watch my speedometer. I get to 70, 75 miles an hour. My foot's got the accelerator gas pedal floored. Now, once I get to 80 miles an hour, that's fast. For a few seconds, I'm thinking, do I really want to go to 90? For just a few seconds, I thought, go for it. 81, 82. 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90 miles per hour, 90 miles an hour. Then I immediately took my foot off the gas pedal accelerator. No, no, no brake. I let the laws of physics I let the laws of physics slow me down. Now, once 
once this once I got down to 70 now 75 75 miles an hour still fast but compared to 90 75 felt like a safe zone and I thought to myself, Lord, if, if you let me get down to the normal speed, I'll never do that again. And I never did. But 90, yeah, I mean, 90, uh, and what surprised me, what really surprised me, how well my car handled. I thought, you know, at 90 miles an hour, I thought something would shatter, or, you know, oh, not shatter, vibrate. I thought the windows would vibrate. That car, when I was driving at 90, it was just as smooth. I, after that little ex, little test, I was very proud of that car, that Plymouth Satellite Sebring. I'm very proud of it. Drove just as smooth. Really was a nice. I'm gonna get me another one, and I'm gonna get the exact one I had it from in 1982. And this time I'll own it. My sister won't half own it. But I'm gonna get me a 1973 black Plymouth Satellite Sebring, same size engine. But uh, I thought I'd probably be stopped by a policeman. And even now, this video, even my, to this day, my dad had no idea I drove 90 miles an hour until, I, until this video. But boy, if I would have got stopped by the law, he uh, probably just wrote me out a $200 ticket. Oh, my dad, even though I was 19, my dad would have, oh, he, 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 he would have probably killed me over, you know, not got you you know not that you got stopped which I did not but if I could have had a wreck or something but he drew I'm not kidding you I was very proud after that after that little 90 mile an hour drive I was very proud of that car it just a sturdy very very good car but never you young adults never ever do that it's far too dangerous you know it was 1982 was much less traffic back then you know stay route 50 straight shot but uh yeah i gunned it to 90 and that still was way too fast but i did it